Hey everyone, it's QC Rider here coming at you with a video of my Hard Rock Cafe collection. Now, for those of you who don't know, the Hard Rock Cafe is my favorite restaurant, and these are just some items that I have accumulated um, over the past couple of years. So uh, let's get started with actually let's get started with the hats. So this hat is from the Hard Rock Amusement Park in Myrtle Beach. I got this off of eBay for 10 bucks. It says, go ahead, make some noise on the bill. And then it says, opening crew 2008 on the back. So that, I thought that was pretty cool. And then I got this just last week. Uh, this is a USA Hard Rock Cafe logo cap. And this is from the Denver Cafe. I got that for my birthday. And then this, this is actually my brother's hat. Uh, this is from the Hard Rock Cafe in Phoenix and it has uh, crossed guitars on the bill. And it's just a plain black hat. There's nothing on it else. So let's get down to over here. Uh, this is a brochure from the Phoenix Cafe. And then um, this is my guitar flash drive. Alright, now we're going to move on to pins. So this is my lanyard. I got this a couple weeks ago. It's the regular original Hard Rock Cafe lanyard that you can currently buy at their cafes now. So here's the little name tag that comes with it. And this is just the little pattern on the lanyard itself. And some of the pins that I have. So let's get started right here. I have the get some lighting in it. This is the Phoenix logo pin and this is um, white guitar which is one of two pins that came with the lanyard and here's the red guitar that's the second pin that came with the lanyard. This is my first hard rock pin that I got. It's the pin for the 2015 Phoenix Comic Con and then this is my brand new pin I got yesterday of the um, of a hot air balloon from the now closed Hard Rock Hotel in Albuquerque, New Mexico. And then this pin, which I always keep in its plastic packaging, it's never been outside of its plastic packaging, is the the double palm tree uh, guitar from the Hard Rock Amusement Park in Myrtle Beach. So those are pins, and these are these are just the two bags that I got. All right, last but not least are the t-shirts. I have a total of about, uh, I believe, eight t-shirts. But let's, let's look here. I got this t-shirt just today. Um, oh, I should also note, I get my t-shirts from either thrift stores or from cafes that I actually go to. And the majority of the t-shirts that I have um, are of cafes that I've never been to. So I got this t-shirt today. It's from uh, the cafe in San, San Francisco. And I should also note that every t Hard Rock shirt that I get is different in some way. So this is the San Francisco shirt. I got this shirt last week. It's from the Cafe in Porto Vallarta. And let me actually flip it over so you can see the back. So this is the back. It has two guitars. Uh, two dolphins, and you could see the skyline right there, and the the beach, save the planet. So that's the Puerto Vallarta shirt. This is the first Hard Rock shirt that I ever got. I actually got this on my first ever visit to a Hard Rock cafe. This is from Denver. This is the skyline T-shirt. This is actually the first shirt that I ever got from a thrift store for Hard Rock. Um, Cabo San Lucas. And then this shirt is, it says Ready to Rock. This is from the hotel in Sioux City. And the logo is actually on the back. And this shirt is from the now closed cafe in Kuwait City. So it has a man riding a camel on the top and the logo looks like a broken disc or record. 
And then this is from the Hard Rock Hotel in Las Vegas, the first ever Hard Rock Hotel. This is one of my favorites. This is the All is One tea, I guess like you can call it, from Hollywood, California. So it has like wings on it and stars. So it's pretty cool. This is the shirt that I probably wear the most often, mostly because it's a classic logo tee. Well, in a darker version of the classic logo tee. This is from the now closed cafe in Newport Beach. And then last but not least, probably one of my favorites. I got this not too long ago for my birthday. It's the flag logo uh, shirt from Denver, Colorado. So you can see the Colorado flag inside of the Hard Rock logo itself. You can see Colorado was written in gray behind it. And the Colorado flag is actually right there. So that's pretty cool. But yeah. Anyways, that is my Hard Rock Cafe collection. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Make sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks and have a great day.